Hey guys, welcome back to Rough Nuts. You're here with Corey today. No Laurie, because she's at work. Uh, woke up this morning fairly early and decided, stuff it, let's do a day trip. So I've come down to Harvey Dam. I've not actually fished this one from the water before. I've done a bit of a shore bash before and with uh, limited results, let's say. So I'm hoping to, um, yeah, get out in the old bathtub, flick a few lures, I can see put up in this spot with a bunch of structure and submerged logs and things and see how we go, see if we can pull out some perch or I hear there's some good good sized trout in here too, so let's get into it. Ew. So we made it out onto the water. I'm um, gonna start by flicking at some of this structure here. A lot of water around, so I've chucked on a deep diver and see how we go. Let's get into it. We've had limited success on the uh, diver, so I think what I might do is chuck on this little yabby thing and see if I get it a bit deeper. Maybe they're hanging out down low because the sun's up. Just got to keep mixing it up. Right. Switch up worked. I just dropped it right to the bottom there next to this tree and we're on the board with uh, the first little one. I don't know how to do this without getting spiked right well they're in there there's only freaking small Oop. there you go where's your bigger ones get back into it something like yep so we were down deeper. Let's see, didn't really see anyone follow him up, but get this right down to the bottom. So the water's a bit cloudy and murky, so I switched to this Z-Man TRD Craw just for a bit more movement. It's a bit of a darker colour, might silhouette better against the sunlight here. Had a bit of success on this in the past, it does look quite nice. Just fire it out there and again let it sink down. Try and get it in whatever zone we need it in. Just where having a sounder might be useful, but you can have a bit of a challenge. Right, so we've been bouncing plastics along the bottom with limited success so far. Had those couple of little ones, but um, yeah, can't find the stonkers. So in the interest of keeping it interesting, uh, I'm gonna go for a bit of a troll, get out of here. I'm gonna put this Halco Scorpion rainbow trout pattern up against 
the new TB55, which I was fishing earlier, and I really want to catch a fish on it, but yeah, we'll see what happens. Um, very different color schemes, a few different depth levels. Hopefully, we find one of these elusive big trout that's rumored to be in uh, Harvey Dam or shit. Just anything would be great. Well, better start paddling. Right, well, a couple of snags here and there, but we're back to um, the little soft plastic marin there. Um, oh, that's too close to my face. Uh, just going to head back down to this uh, bunch of structure you know, the, where we started. Flick along the bank here, there's some trees and drop-offs and things. Um, the weather's sort of clouding over every now and then, so that might help. Um, it could be that they're just a bit sunshine is all. So yeah, stick with us. We'll get one eventually. It's got a bit more weight to it. Oh, it's wrapping around a log or something. All right. Stand by. We're gonna have to get him out of this. Leave it on, it just re rigged as well. Alright. Alright, we're off, we're off the log. And there he is. Only a little one. He must have had me around the bloody log the whole time. Little bastard. Right, well, three at once. Back to it. First inning's done, pretty big one, a lot of paddling. Decided I'm gonna stop and have a bite and a brew, and then, um, yeah, just suss out what I'm gonna do from here. Whether I try that structure again, or whether I throw the boat on and we hit a different section. We'll make it up as we go. Yeah. All right, after a bite and a brew, I've decided to chuck the boat back on top, uh, and I'm gonna head up to Drakesbrook to have a look there. I haven't put the boat in there before, so may as well make the most of a good day and yeah, see if we can find some trout already there. Stay with us. Okay. So out here at Drakesbrook now, um, obviously the boat's in the water, doesn't look like the wind's got here, so that's good. Uh, we're going to get into it now. So, I'm going to start off with a bit of a trawling, uh, put the TB55 back on because basically I'm determined to catch something with it, and it's got a nice deep dive to it. So, get this out there. We'll go for a trough.
Okay, that's it for this episode, guys. Uh, we did Harvey Dam and Drakesbrook Weir with limited success. Nothing at Drakesbrook. Three little reddies at uh, Harvey. I was hunting horses and I only got ponies, but you know, there's a lot of water in these dams and yeah, I'm doing a lot of paddling. If you've got any tips or tricks on how to find them when you don't have a sounder and without having to basically paddle the length of the Atlantic Ocean, let us know. Any help's appreciated. Um, other than that, it's good to get out and about, getting active, the weather's getting better. If you like it all, like, subscribe, hit that notification button, and yeah, we'll see you out there next time.